The Mexico Aztec pattern is one of football shirts' great designs, but how much do you know about these legendary kits? The design depicts the Aztec calendar, or sunstone, with the face of the sun god at the center. It was made by Mexican brand ABA Sport, who are part of the business empire of Monterrey president Jorge Lancanao. And it was designed by Ricardo Guzman, who said he drew it in just 30 minutes. Give that man a medal. Mexico began wearing the shirt at the Gold Cup in 96, a tournament they won, beating Brazil in the final. This version with a plain white collar and red pattern cuffs was used up until the 1998 World Cup. For France 98, the design was changed slightly. I'll do a comparison for you with the away shirts. Firstly, the material is much more lightweight and ventilated, with the ABA Sport jacquard removed too. A national flag was added to the right sleeve, and a red stripe added to the collar, while the cuffs have the national flag colours rather than the intricate pattern. The Mexico and ABA Sport text were changed from green to red, although it remained white on the home shirts. Everybody wanted a Mexico shirt in the summer of 98, not only for the Aztec design, but for the long blonde hair of Luis Hernandez, and for the Blanco bounce. Jorge Campos would rather play in goal wearing the Aztec shirt than one of his crazy homemade masterpieces. That says it all, really. Even Lothar Mateus got himself one. And a mention, too, for flat cap wearing manager Manuel La Puente. For some unknown reason, a third shirt was produced, too, with the Aztec design in red, which created one of the most garish concoctions ever. It was only used once in a friendly against Ecuador in 97. A young Rafael Marquez made his debut on this day too. After the World Cup, a new brand, Garcis, became the kit supplier, and they continued with the Mexican iconography style until the year 2000. Is this the best Mexico shirt ever? Has to be, doesn't it? Let me know what you think.